I sold one of my other um, handbags bag strap this one is um, this is I believe canvas or cotton cone with uh, leather ends and um, silver clasps or whatever they're called and this sold for my full asking price of $19.99 and I can sell these every day for that price they go uh, very well and uh, the least that I um, I get for them is about $17 um, and that's um, when somebody wants a bargain but usually people just buy them for $19.99 and I usually get them for about a dollar um, no more than two dollars I took a best offer on these um, of $40 plus uh, $9.99 shipping um, I'm gonna have to send them FedEx um, because um, it's costing me actually over $10.40 to ship it so with FedEx it might take a day or so, or, or so longer but um, it's cheaper shipping um, and I believe I purchased these for six dollars I've had them on for quite some time so I'm happy to see them go I hope the person likes them it's a men's size 11 I sold these brand new Trafalgar um, men's suspenders there's that brand um, and they're brand new um, looks like they were never used and this is the woven leather I purchased it for $2.99 and they sold for they sold pretty quickly for my full asking price of $28.90 which I'm really happy about so this nice um, lot of La Franc um, I believe this is a French Mm, aquarelle brand uh, of paint for an artist I believe on canvas and um, I took a best offer of $45 um, I had them for I would say maybe four months or so so I hope they go into good hands so this uh, these um, dance go sandals the style is called Sophie and um, they were sold for my full asking price of $39.99 plus shipping and I do not remember where I purchased them but I probably paid either $4 or $6 for them I had these listed for um, $39.99 plus shipping and I had um, the buyer or the buyer offered me um, $33.20 and with shipping so that he can pay forty dollars for um, this set um, with shipping and I did accept so um, I am getting ready to pack them up and I believe I purchased them I think it was four dollars this black Nike hat um, could be either for men or women uh, sold on auction for eleven twenty-five, and I got it at the blue bins probably it cost me 20 or 30 cents because it's pretty light so this nice um, pottery barn this is called linen texture beige um, pillow cover and it sold an auction for $14.95 and um, I believe I found this one at the blue bins um, with the pillow and it was um, used by me but uh, my taste changed so I updated some of my pillows and I wanted to sell this one so there you go this sold um for best offer of twelve dollars i do not remember where i purchased it if it was the blue bins or if it was a retail store um, for goodwill i believe most likely blue bins because it had this stain and um, i'm not sure if that can come off 
but I've had it for about two months or so yeah, and uh, I'm just in the mood of getting rid of stuff so I just took uh, 12 bucks which is which is cool but this brand right here Garnet Hill is pretty um, expensive similar to Pottery Barn I think but maybe this is a step down anyhow I'm, I'm glad I sold it I sold this um, kind of like a hard case Ray-Band for um, glasses or sunglasses and I purchased it for $1.99 at a Goodwill store and I sold it for my full asking price of $19.99 sold these aqua lung echo zip ergo water sport little booties that zip up and it's a men's size 13 I had them um, as of uh, last year and uh, I am finally uh, happy that they sold and um, this is my second pair of water sport shoes so I'm glad they sold oh yeah <laughs> and the price was $29.99 with shipping and I do not remember how much it paid for them sorry guys I sold the C.S. Lewis um, signature classic mere Christianity book um, from 2001 for $9.55 with free shipping. Um, I purchased this paper book, um, or paperback book, for $0.25 cents at the outlet store. These Nike Air Zoom rollerblades, or uh, hockey inline skates, uh, sold for my full asking price of $119.99. This same person actually sent me an offer of $100 and then they um, actually paid full price right after that. Uh, so I'm happy and I purchased them for $2 at my uh, Goodwill outlet store. And I believe I did a haul video on these um, in my other haul videos um, I am very excited I hope he likes them um, I haven't heard anything back from him and it's been about a week already I actually had um, two of these this is the smaller kind um, jar or canister I had a set of two of these uh, one bigger and one smaller that I listed them together and one buyer sent me um, an offer of $75 uh, for the bigger one and I took it and I purchased that other one for about I think $4 um, and then I just had this one listed this is the smaller kind but it's uh, made in Italy and this um, one is really really hard to find and I took a best offer of $50 and this one I believe was purchased for $2.99 this is my second time selling this uh, Machino um, vintage uh, 90s bag. The first time I sold it for a best offer of $100 and the buyer did not pay for it. And the case closed without payment and um, I took a best offer of $80 for this bag second time around by somebody else. And I believe I purchased it probably for either $4 or $6. I took a best offer of $25 for these um, Trafalgar uh, suspenders. They are uh, black um, and white. They were brand new without tags. Um, and I purchased them for $2.99 at the um, retail store, Goodwill retail store. Um, I have two of these same exact belts. Um, this one is. Um, it's a coach linen with brown leather. It's a unisex belt, uh, size 40. And um, I had this one on uh, Buy It Now or Best Offer and it sold for $29.99. And I had another one starting bid $24 um, on auction and that one was did not sell. But this one, I guess people like the Buy It Now option a lot. 
Um, this was purchased at my Goodwill retail store for $1.99. I took a best offer on this vintage uh, Italian portfolio or teacher satchel bag. Um, did I say $50? And I purchased it for either four or six dollars. Um, it was a uh, very nice condition except the small tear that I did list in uh, the description and with the picture. So I'm very happy that it sold. These Sanuk runaround slip on shoes. Um, they're brand new without tags or box and uh, I took a best offer of $25 and they were purchased for six dollars at the thrift store. Um, this US military uh, pure wool blanket um, in army green sold my for my full asking price of $49.90 and I purchased this at the blue bins probably no more than five dollars that I paid for it. Um, this is my second blanket uh, that I sold and I believe I have one more left that I still need to measure and list. I guess I better do it since uh, the winter season has come to an end. Maybe somebody can still use it. I don't want it laying around um, for a whole year. 